You'd be hard pressed to find a chainsaw not running today. So this is gonna be an interesting one to get down. Trees snapped, or in some cases, straddled on top of roads all over Holmes County after a night of straight line winds reported up to 90 miles an hour. My three-year-old has experienced something I'm not sure I ever have in my 40 years. Rural roads became a maze between those that were closed and perhaps those that should have been. At its worst, those at AEP Ohio say 150,000 were without power. And if there wasn't already a push to restore power, just about everyone is aware of the impending heat wave in the 90s expected tomorrow. You know, make sure you're making plans now. Uh, you know, this, these outages, you know, could be extended depending on where you are and the impact of the damage. It was just so windy and so violent. For Philip Beachy, the wind got the best of the two-year-old roof at his business, Tons Honey. We process raw honey and put it in from barrel into the bottle and ready for your table. However, almost as fast as his roof came off, it's going back on. Because when Mother Nature is at its worst, human nature is at its best. This community rallies around disaster. You just get the word out and people come to help. In Holmes County, Clay Lepard, News 5.